guys, welcome back to another video here on my channel. I hope you're having a lovely day. Um, today I have something pretty cool for you. Um, I wanted to do a starter cube. Uh, however, it did not end up being a starter cube, but I tried. An effort was made and this is the result. Um, what happened basically was my game just completely glitched out at one point, uh, which deleted a TV, a and just a load of uh, like decorative items and it just deleted them all but it didn't take the money out because sims likes to glitch on me you know it's just i'm not saying that it's only me that gets glitched on but it happens a lot and it's really annoying <laughs> so um i got to a point where that happened and i just said do you know what i don't care anymore we're gonna do a nice house we're gonna build this as i want it so what it is now is a studio apartment type house and a massive train just went past i'm sorry if you heard that um it's still going it's still going why must you do this to me when i'm recording a voiceover uh, anyway <laughs> we'll just pretend that isn't there i live right by a train line so what can you do what can you do I'm sorry, it's still going now, <laughs> how long is this drain? Anyway, so um, yeah, it turns out to be a studio apartment uh, and it's quite industrial in the end. The train has gone, guys, how exciting. Um, yeah, it's quite an industrial looking um, apartment, which is so up my street and uh, which is why I do a lot of uh, these kind of builds because I love it. Anyway, so um, yeah, I, I really wanted to separate, I didn't want, to open the front door into the kitchen like immediately but kind of I had to in the end I, there was no real way of me getting out of it so didn't end up doing that but it does end up looking a lot better especially um, as uh, I I do the whole I don't care this isn't a star build anymore thing so yeah anyway so um, this is just a one bedroom as you could probably guess and one bathroom and it's just yeah it, it is like an apartment i can imagine this actually very much being an apartment in in an apartment building which is something i actually quite want to build but i know it'll just take me a year to do um just a massive apartment block it would just take me so long because this took me what like two hours <laughs> to do this including doing screenshots and all of that kind of stuff but it just it and I take breaks so I cut some stuff out but um just it would take me so long so I could be I could do it as a series I guess um yeah I could do it as a series actually maybe I will do that there's so many things I want to do talking of which actually um very exciting that new crest is coming out which is a blank world which I'm sure that we've all heard of by now um, it's a new world that Sims 4 are releasing, which is very cool uh, for free. You can just download it. Um, it's not out yet, but when it is out, you can just download it for free. And uh, yeah, it's it's got nothing in it. <laughs> it's just a blank world, which is very good for us builders out here. Um, but yeah, so I'm very much excited uh, about building that. And I think what I'll probably do is a series of uh, videos which is just filling up Newcrest because what I've wanted to do actually is delete either Oasis Springs or Willow Creek houses uh, or builds, community lots, everything and just um, completely refill it with uh, new builds that all go well together but I never really did it, I never <laughs> really had the motivation to do it, I really like just doing look like random looking houses if that makes sense I just like to sort of do what I want at the time so I never got around to doing it but now that we have a new world coming out it seems very fitting it seems like a good idea to do that right right like that makes sense you know so maybe I'll do that who knows mm, I'm not making any promises but mm, maybe I will maybe I won't anyway so um yeah it's very open plan this house and that's the way I like it. That's what I really enjoy doing. Um, I haven't really done a huge amount of open plan, have I? Stuff I've done, mm, kind of, no, not really. I haven't done a huge amount of open plan stuff on my channel. But, but that's, I tell you why that is. It's because on Sims 3, I used to always, always do open plan stuff. And um, I just don't really do it anymore. I think I kind of got bored of it. Um, but honestly, the results, 
all, are always my favourite for me, so that's what I like to do. Um, anyway, so I put in that little pillar there, just separating off the sitting area and the kitchen, just because I don't know if there's a way, there probably is a way and I'm just being dumb, but there, I can't seem to find a way of getting the like bar counter things to sort of fit in with the kitchen counter things. <laughs> That was a really good description, wasn't it? You are all welcome. I'm sure you all knew exactly what I was trying to say there, but if do you know what I'm saying? Do you know what I mean? I hope, I hope so. Um, so I just put in that pillar. It's just a good way to get around that, just to make a little uh, little pillar there, um, which is actually a trick I learned in Sims 3. I used to do it all the time in Sims 3. <laughs> Nothing changes, according to me. Nothing changes in my life. Just all the same thing. Um, so yeah, I, I put in those two cabinets there, just um, by the bathroom, kind of, and next to the bedroom as well, because I had nothing to do with that space, and I was just like, what do I do? So I was like, this house needs storage, so storage, you're welcome, anytime. Thank you very much, thank you, good idea, great, phenomenal. Um, so yeah, at this point we are still making this into a starter home, which is why it kind of looks a bit bare like that little sitting kit uh duck lounge area even it just looks so empty it's just like a sofa a chair and a table <laughs> um yep i that 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 is what you have to do with start homes unfortunately but um i do end up changing it as i say i'll show you when it does get glitch out on me and i pay life and i just want to punch several people uh it made me a little bit angry <laughs> I didn't like rage quit or anything like that, but it, I, I was certainly annoyed and upset. And I was like, it was going so well. Um, and yeah, I think this is the time where I do a cool little entertainment system. Apparently not, this is where I put a bush in. Uh, but after this maybe is when I put in this entertainment system, which I think is pretty cool. Well, it's not an entertainment system, it's, it's just like cabinets. <laughs> But I, I uh, put a TV in there, so it's an entertainment system, you know? In my head, that's just how it works. Um, yeah, here it comes, here it comes. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen any moment now after result, re exhausting every other option. Here it comes. Are you ready for this? Oh, damn. Oh, look at this. Mm, mm, mm. Looks like a weird Minecraft character. Oh, yeah. Um, it doesn't end up looking like this. I mean, it does, but I add other stuff as well to make it look slightly more sort of normal, not so strange. Um, but yeah, I just thought this was a cool idea. Um, it, some people may think it looks really bad, and quite frankly, at the moment, this is not looking great, but when I add the other stuff, it looks better, okay? Just take my word for it. Until then, we have to live with it the way it is. Oh yeah, here we go. There's one other bit I put in there. Just put a little lamp, that glass lamp, by the way, which is kind of next to the TV. I think that's so cool. And I wish more people used it, but they just, they just don't. And I put in this mirror there because, okay, little interior design tip for you, if you don't know this already. Mirrors make rooms look bigger. They just do because they reflect and stuff. So <laughs> did you like that very scientific explanation? They reflect and stuff. So that's just how it works. Um, but yeah, mirrors make rooms look bigger, not that, um, it, it, not necessarily in Sims, but definitely in real life it makes rooms look a lot bigger. So, you know, if you want to make a room look bigger, mirrors, you're welcome, anytime. So anyway, working on the outside, I, I'm not a huge fan of the outside of this build, um, just because, I don't know, I just... I'm not a very, like, interior design is my thing. In The interiors are my thing. It's what I enjoy about Sims the most. But building is not my thing. Like, if you watch, I don't know, someone like Simified or Dutch Sims Master, so good at building. So, so, so good at building. But this is, by the way, where all of the stuff glitched out and just didn't... <sighs> the stress it caused me. Because <laughs> I really wanted to do this build very quickly. And I was like, I'll do a starter cube. That's easy. That's quick. And it just turned out to take me ages, so yeah. And it didn't take the money away, especially if you're on a tight budget like you are when you do a starter home. To have a TV disappear is a pretty major thing. So this is the point where I just deleted a load of stuff and was like, 
I don't care, we're making this house nice, I don't like this result, because I get very funny because, um, just show you the roof there, um, just, if something isn't up to scratch, I know about it, and I don't like it at all, so, um, yeah, I'm not a happy person, and then this is just the point where I'm just like, screw it, it's all going, we're replacing it with nice stuff, and I'm just gonna have a drink. I've <sighs> got very sore throat from all this talking. Um, and yeah, so I, I just change it to look more industrial and nicer and everything, so yeah, yes. Um, as I was saying, building is not my strong suit, I don't think. Um, I'm much more into the interiors of a house rather than, you know, the exteriors. I, I mean, honestly, good looking exterior houses. I think it was, was it Dutch Sims Master? I think it was him, did a very, very, very cool build the other day. And I was just like in awe, I was like, wow. It was, it was, it was a villa of some kind. Anyway, it's such a cool build. And I was just like, how does he do that? <laughs> I can't do that and um so yeah that's the goal that is not what I do though I I don't I don't know how he does it but he does it and it looks very very cool so yeah go and check that out if you want to it's very very cool um and so yeah interiors are my thing exteriors are not so much my thing and that's my excuse I'm sticking with it <laughs> um anyway so I wanted to fit that rug in somewhere but I just I just couldn't my favorite stripy rug it just couldn't go in here it was just too big it didn't it didn't make sense um but it's fine we can live without that rug we can live for like one build <laughs> I'm sure we can deal with it putting up two of my favorite paintings as well I do get worried you know that all my bills look the same because I I do see myself or find myself using the same stuff a lot um, which kind of bothers me um, and is a reason why I never really know what to do you know because I just I don't want to bore people <laughs> with my bills if you know what I mean like I want people to come to my channel and be like oh she does cool stuff every time. I don't know. I and I, I feel like sometimes a lot of my builds are very samey samey, but I don't know. I don't know how I feel. I just I just that's just how I feel and yeah, um anyway. <laughs> uh I was thinking on that note of doing like a farmhouse type build and okay, so here's the thing, right? On before I started making videos I was already building stuff and putting it onto the gallery and um which was a lot of fun i've really really enjoyed it um however it means that a lot of the cool stuff i would just basically be replicating it um i wouldn't do it exactly the same obviously i wouldn't want to do that my window just like blew open lovely got a lovely nice breeze now um but i don't want to like replicate all of the things that i've done before if that makes sense um, because they're already on the gallery but at the same time I really like those builds like especially the farmhouse and stuff I really enjoyed doing that and I, it was it was definitely one of my favorite um, builds that I've done so I kind of think I might just redo it if that makes sense and upload it to the channel and uh, we can just pretend that I've not done it before or something like that. I don't know. I'll we'll see what happens But I do want to make another farmhouse uh, kind of all barn house Kind of looking build because I really I Really enjoyed it. It was just so not what I am used to doing which makes it interesting and fun and cool and enjoyable So yeah, that's that might be something to look out for uh, we are actually nearing the end of the build, kind of, not really, ish, sort of. We are kind of, there's not a huge amount extra that comes in on this build. I am very cold all of a sudden, my window is just like letting all the cold air in. Not that it's freezing, but it's not, it's not warm air, you know, it's, it's, it's cold. Anyway, so, um, yeah, this is basically how the house room open plan living area <laughs> looks like 
Um, now we're coming up towards the end of the build. Blimey. I could have used my eyes and I didn't. Um, anyway, yeah, just putting a TV and a little stereo in the in the sleeping area, which I think is pretty cool. And I wanted to put something under the um, shelves, but I couldn't think what to put in there. But I did end up putting in a washing basket. Genius. That was like a genius moment in my mind. Uh, <laughs> I was just like, I am so clever. <laughs> Um, anyway, so we are now coming up to the screenshots. Ah, there we are. And we've got Logan there. I think that's his name. Just, he's in all of my builds. He's just, he's like my model. Anyway, um, I hope you guys liked this build. Uh, if you did, comment, rate, subscribe. Rate? Oh, God, that was, that's so old school. <laughs> comment, like, subscribe. Um, and if you have any requests of things, that you want me to build or you want to build but can't be asked then just leave a comment and I will uh, do it for you probably and um, yes yeah, so thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed I will see you next time bye